What's up, y'all? My name is I'm Too Crispy, and I'm answering some dumbass questions on some dumbass website. Yeah, I actually said just some random light skin men. Yes. Okay, can we just admire the contributors here? Certified anime and K-pop expert. You, you, you guys got to appreciate what I'm doing right here, man, because seeing K-pop expert and anime in the same sentence is just a red flag. Like, 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 look at this shit right here. How can you be a part-time K-pop fangirl? Bro, it's, I, it, it's either you're a fan of it or you're not. <laughs> I don't understand. First question. What's an anime you watched early in your anime journey that you wouldn't watch now? Um, I obviously would like to take back the time I started watching Kuroko no Basket. Um, I honestly thought that that anime was going to be trash in the first place. And the anime proved me right. I honestly think that that anime is just... The thing is, superpowers and sports just don't link, you know? So I, it's, 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 just, it's just something that shouldn't be go, uh, go together. Honestly, Kuroko no Basket is just ass. Yes, it's actually me. What is the most logical anime? The fuck they mean logical? What? I mean, that the one that makes you think? I mean, I guess you could say... Man, what's an anime that makes, that makes you have to think? Okay. Okay. I have three that can be in that... That could, in my opinion, could be in that category. Because if, if you mean the ones that you have to like really think about in order to like watch... And like, like, do you have to stop and think like what's going on in order to like, oh snap, that shit is actually sick. Then, then, um, then it's gonna be Steins Gate, Full Metal Alchemist. Uh, it doesn't matter Alchemist or Brotherhood. Uh, and the second season of Attack on Titan. Because like, if you are a dumb ass nigga, I honestly think you won't be able to sit through it, and you're just gonna say those animes are ass. All right, I, 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 I don't blame you, but like. It's like riddles in between the voice lines, you know? You have to listen in between the lines. You got to watch the shit in the background. This is why I watch dub, bro. Because, like, subtitles ain't going to help me look in the background, bro. I saw Berto biting his hand. I knew that shit was coming. I didn't see that line of shit coming. Though. But those are my three. Because, honestly, if you, like, watch those shows and, like, you're, you're actually like not thinking about like what's going on in the show. You can't have that shit in the background, and you're gonna you're you're gonna say this shit is ass because you're not paying attention. These are the three shows that you have to like pay attention to in order to get through it, which is like most anime to be honest, man. But like these three, you like really have to pay attention. Like some shit you could put on the background, you'll say it's like one of the greatest things ever. Like K on, you could put that shit in the background. You get shit fucking full of full of time got me twerk. I mean, nope. Mm -mm, cut that shit. Anyways, you honestly, through these three specific anime, these are the only three that I feel like you have to sit, rethink about what just happened in order to understand what's going on. Because if you don't understand what's going on, you're not going to enjoy it, and people are going to call you a dumbass for the rest of your life. <laughs> what, is this? what anime are about writers? Oh! What's the, what's the, what's that shit called? Uh... Monthly Girls No Zaki Kun. There we go. Yeah, Monthly Girls No Zaki Kun. It's pretty decent, to be honest. I give it a watch. I just would. It needs a second season, though. Answering mad questions. Yo, if I make this shit blow up one day, I don't know what to do. Because, like, this is, like, actually me type shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Why does Kakashi act so lazy? All right. Here's the thing, man. See, you know how Kakashi has the makeout series as his, like, primary book? Um, I just feel like, it, I don't even think he's tired. I think he's like, you know what? No, he is tired. He, he is lazy. It, it, because training with Team 7 is his post-workout. He has the makeout series, which is made by Jiraiya, out of all people. That shit is most definitely hentai. All right? That, you, you already know he's stroking his shit before practice. I don't know what the fuck is wrong with him. But, like, that has to be the answer, you know? 
<laughs> oh man, I'm gonna get banned off this shit. I mean, like, it's actually me, so I'm not surprised. This is the first anime one should watch. Oh, that's that's a that's 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 a tough one. This this is straightforward, but like a super hard question to answer. Because so many people have different tastes. Like, of course, one would say the big three, you know, but there are, there are a lot of people that have not watched the big three or four, the big three in Dragon Ball, you know, like James has never watched. He's just starting to watch Naruto and James has watched a lot of anime. He hasn't watched Bleach. He hasn't watched One Piece and he hasn't watched Dragon Ball. He hates Dragon Ball. So like, he has even watched Fairy Tale, where you could put in that number five spot right after. So like, it's it's really hard to choose. Like, so traditionally the big three, along with Dragon Ball, but it more so depends on your taste. And other anime is just like you know your Jutsu Kaisen, Demon Slayer, Black Clover, My Hero. Uh, like those are like your starter pack if you want to get the basis of what's like. Of what's like more like pop culture and uh, and anime, what what they're used, what people are used to right now. But the thing about it is though, like there's ma there's so many genres of anime that like freaking Boku no Pico could be a good first anime to watch, and it what <laughs> it wouldn't surprise me. Freaking um, the, the, there's a lot of addicts out there, man. Uh, so that category could be another one. Uh. Death Note is another good anime. Full Metal is usually one that's popped up. Attack on Titan is a lot of people's first animes as well. Um, bro, even kid shit. Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh! Beyblade. And, and if you into like regular like regular television, like think of stuff like uh Toradora. Uh freaking My Dress Up Dog is even a good anime to start off with. You know, and that just came out. Spy X Family just came out. There's just so much anime that even, there's just so much anime that came out that could be counted as a first anime that you just gotta like ask people around, like, yo, you know, I like this stuff, right? So, what do you think I should get into first? So I say just ask around. And sent. Yes, actually, me. I won't. I'm. I'm praying I don't get banned from this site. <laughs> uh, can a person transform into Super Saiyan? No. Yes. There's a daily limit of submissions? You've got to be kidding me. Hang on, let me see some other questions. Can Sakura solo Dragon Ball verse? I think she... Who the fuck? Oh, man, I wish I answered this question, yo. I'm saving this question. I'm saving this question. Oh my gosh, I'm saving this question. Oh my gosh, I'm saving this question. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait for a part two of this shit. Okay, all right, all right. They scared me for a bit. You don't, you don't have to bring up Weiss. This is funny, this is funny, this is funny. <laughs> That's actually funny, but uh, oh. So that, that, that was an unintended pun but that's it for today sadly I, I, I've reached my limit I guess I don't know what the, that means but uh, I hope you enjoyed this um, this video from uh, I'm too and I'll see you guys um, later I guess deuces